Hi F2Ps, it's Goodfellow here from F2Pa.com and today we are checking out Zula, a free-to-play MMO FPS from IDC Games. Uh, it is a modern day shooter that is very much in the style of some older FPS games, the likes of Crossfire I guess, which isn't actually that old but that is in itself an old style FPS that's more in line with something like um, Counter-Strike Global Offensive. Those kind of games, they get kind of rehashed and thrown out every so often uh, and Zula just appears to be another one on the list. I believe it's developed by a Turkish developer so it's kind of relatively successful in Turkey and, and it's now kind of doing the rounds to a more global market. Uh, it's available as a client download and available through Steam. So you can check it out there. It is currently open access, free to play, anybody can jump in on it. And when you log in, this is what you look at and you've got some different servers. I, I've never seen anybody in servers three and four. So it's kind of server one, not a massive population, playing a bit of a, an odd time for us at the moment. You also have clan servers as well, so yeah. it's just, uh, it's useful. Um, so yeah, so we're not um, got loads of people playing at the moment, so we're just going to jump into a quick team deathmatch if we can before they get filled up, um, and then we can kind of go over other stuff. So, there are currently five game modes deathmatch, team deathmatch, sabotage, which is your classic bomb plant, bomb defense, there's capture the flag, and then there is wanted, which I've not had a chance to play, but I believe it is kind of like VIP where. Um, you have, oh, have I started with this? I don't, I really don't want my uh, sniper rifle in this map, I don't think. Go on, put your back up. Oh, somebody else going because I am rubbish at FPS games. I have absolutely no quick fire skills whatsoever. Ah, I cannot see. Um, yeah, so Pfft, I suck. B change. There we go. Right, let's get on to. Uh, there we go. I managed to change. So you've got four different loadouts, which is good. Anyway, uh, wanted is um, more of a. Uh, oh no! That was a good shot. That was a good shot, son. Um, yeah, one person's on. Uh, one person's like under attack and everybody else is trying to get them and then when you kill that person you become the person who is it. God damn it. I was just there for cover for, for uh, this dude running. Uh, okay. So yeah, so you can have four... Oh, you're camping in spawn point? What a flipper. Um, I'm getting a weird little bit of flicker across my screen in some places. Seems to be okay over here. I'm gonna follow this dude. Ah, stop firing at me. Um. Yeah, so five different game modes with the team deathmatch, and I'm not sure whether it's with other games as well. You do have the option of um, kind of choosing the weapons that are available. You can choose the score like that you want to go up to. So we're going up to 200 by the looks of it. Man, I suck so bad at these games. <laughs> Anybody who played these this late is probably a little bit better than I am anyway. <laughs> um, Actually, let's have a look. So you can see the rank wise. Yeah, everybody's fairly decent ranks. And there's no. Uh, there's no kind of game matchmaking. Headshot. Yeah, headshot, that's what I'm talking about. Headhunter. That's what I'm talking about. Two of you. I've not got a grenade. 
Okay. I went through all. Ah! You did, Sims. Okay. That's why first to clan, then I'm gonna jump in. Ah! <laughs> no! Man, that smoke. Okay, we won. That smoke stays around for quite a while. It's quite surprising. Um. Okay, so as I was saying, um, I don't know. I can't. I can't remember. Lost track because I was trying to play. <laughs> uh, okay. Woo! We got a wooden crate. You'll get five material cases. Um, okay. So it's where you just get gear and stuff like that. We get materials, iron. Um, I'll explain some of the other features after we've played a couple of games. Are they going to just jump into another team deathmatch? What they're going for? Oh, that's what I was saying. Yeah, so you could you can choose your. Um oh, it's just all death matches and team death matches at the moment. Nobody play nobody plays the other matches. That's the problem. The other game modes. So we're probably just going to be checking out team death match, but whatever. Um. Yeah, so you got four different uh, loadouts: assault rifles, sniper rifles, shotguns. Those are your main. Um, your prime, your main primary weapons. Then you've got different um, pistols, various melee weapons. So you can get axes, things like that, and then different grenades. So flashbangs, uh, smoke grenades, and then frag grenades. Um, and as you saw, you can change between your loadouts um, between deaths, which is pretty cool. And you get four of them. So again, that's that's not too bad. Um, oh, they were on the same map. Okay, well we'll go on the same map and then we'll see if there's any other players going on anything else. Uh, no, uh, no, let's not. It's not going in. Let's let's find a different. Uh, so that's two out of two. They're going wedding hall. Okay, let's just go on cyber cafe. It's death match. Um, so there's not a lot of game modes. Um, so like I said, there's five. There are quite a lot of maps though which is pretty good um, and they are relatively detailed decent layout so you know it's pretty cool um, I have no idea where this map goes I've not been on this one before I don't think well I, 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 I'm saying I don't think I know I'm gonna try shotgun let's go for a shotgun I've not used a shotgun before I never see anybody using a shotgun though, so that's probably not a, a good good idea. Wah, wah. Oh fuck! Yeah. <laughs> okay, shotgun's pretty cool because it's pretty close quarters, so I, I don't mind that. Oh, okay. The respawn's pretty all over the shop. What's the... Yeah, it's fine. I think the, that's in the, little, the weird little bar thing I'm getting. Leader killer. Leader killer. <laughs> I've got some... Ah, I knew he was there though, because I, I, I saw them firing in front of me. Sandwiched. You get so focused on trying to get the person ahead of you. <laughs> I should have just thrown a grenade in. That's what I need to do. Uh, yeah, so I mean, it's pretty. I mean, it's fun. Don't get me wrong. So hopeful. Where am I at? I just suck so bad. Yeah, that's what you get. Yeah, that's what you get. Ah! That's that was kind of like my moment in the sun for a second there. Enjoy that.
<laughs> They're everywhere. Yeah, I don't I don't know what the score goes up to. Can you destroy anything? Uh, yes, I think this little weird line I'm getting is like... Oh damn, I thought he went into the room. Uh, yeah, it's just from when I spawn and you're kind of like fading a little bit. <sighs> you can't, you just can't stop, you just can't stop. It's chaos, absolute chaos. Revenge. Revenge. Oh man, just can't run fast enough. <laughs> just running around getting killed. Okay, I'm not gonna play this forever. And let, let's see, we'll, we'll try and get two more kills. Yeah, double kill. Okay, we'll call that a day when I next die. And that's then. Okay. So we'll exit. We don't get any benefits and stuff like that. So okay, there you go. That is that is the game. Like I said, it's 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 it's, it's fun. I can't argue with that. Um. <sighs> okay, well, I could try and jump to this while we're talking about stuff. So, can I go into other areas? I can. Okay. Oh. Yeah, yeah, I'm ready, I'm ready, I'm ready, I'm ready. Okay, so this is wanted. I think it's basically you earn points while you're the person that is wanted. Uh, and we're on construction site, so it's a different map as well. Okay, so I'll talk about the other stuff while we are playing. Um, so, one of the key things with the game is that you earn um, Zula points, which is the default. <laughs> A good start. Oh god, yeah, let's. Uh, we're not gonna have a shot there, I don't think. Okay. Check this guy behind me. You are wanted. I'm wanted because I'm badass. I think there is li literally like a star always floating over my head, so. Like, they can always like find where I am, I think. I don't know, because I've never played this game before. It's a trick. Oh man, I am rocking the show. I'm just gonna keep sticking around here. You don't know me. Killed wanted. Ooh, so close. Uh, yeah. So you have. Zula points, which is the standard currency, and you can buy stuff in the game. Killed wanted. Where are you at? Where are you at? Oh! How did you know I was there, you little wall hacker? Um, and yeah, so you go into the shop, you buy different gear and stuff like that. Um, Huh? God damn it! I should have just grenaded him. Um, Zula points are kind of like the, the normal currency. Then you have gold, or I think it's actually Zula gold, which is. How is he not dead? What is this BS? Who is this guy? This I don't know what kind of gear he's got. Anyway, it does seem like most of... There's only three of us. Um, yeah, so when you, you hire gear, um, you only hire it. You can only get it for one day, seven days. I want him to kill him so that I can then kill him. 
I don't know how much vulnerabil invulnerability you get once you become wanted, though. Killed wanted. Point blank shot and sniper rifle. Screw this guy. So he's got five kills, does he? I don't know. Um. Oh, this is a different place. Off. I suck at this game so bad. <laughs> um, so yeah, so you can get it for one day, seven days, twenty-four days, and I I lost big time. That was terrible. Okay, that's that's showing the match. Okay, let me now talk. It's very hard trying to play and talk at the same time. Okay. Yep, 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 yep. Case open, yeah, okay. That's fine, yep. Okay. Uh, so, you go into the store. You can buy stuff with Zula points, or but with Zula points you need to level up. Uh, a lot of the gear is level locked, so I cannot get this at all. However, if I have the premium currency, which is Zula Gold, I can buy these items. It doesn't matter whether it is this item, which is premium, or this item. Okay, well, my level's not high enough to buy that, so um, let me find something that I can... There we go. Or this item. You only ever rent them. It's only over 24 hours, 7 days, 30 days. You don't buy stuff permanently, even with the premium currency stuff, which I suppose it's a constant money sink for people, but I know people generally don't like to have to keep paying for a weapon um, where you're permanently renting it. Now, they have the upgrade system. Your upgrade, uh, upgradable weapons time has expired. To continue for upgrade process, please extend your weapon duration. Um, so, you have different weapons. Now, this is interesting because I've not been able to check this out before. Um, so, this is quite new to me. Let's see if we can actually do anything. Um, so, we can buy stuff with gold. Okay. That Okay, so that increases your chances of success. Um I'm previously when I've been buying weapons, it's been telling me that I didn't have any weapons that I could upgrade. So now I'm kind of getting a bit of a better look of the game, which is nice. That's, you know, this particular system. So I can upgrade the costume. Failure to failure chance for this process is, is 100%. I'll lose 50 cents. Okay, so I don't want to do that because I lose everything. So chance of success. Um, how do I increase my chance of success without just paying gold? Okay, one usage. Okay, so I can buy that one usage for 10,000 gold. The item you selected has been transferred to your bag. Okay. Let's, let's, let's buy another one. What? I don't get what this is. This makes no sense. Okay, where is there an I button? There's not. Okay, so it doesn't really explain how this even works. Maximum? What? Choose cancel now. Okay, I don't know. I don't know how this works. The, I mean, and the the website is garbage, and the forums have no information on for telling you how this stuff works. So, what about the help? Does help say anything? No. Okay. Help doesn't <laughs> do anything either. Okay, but essentially you upgrade stuff and it, in, it improves stuff. There you go, by spending the materials um, that I get from the games. Iron, Chrome, and Titanium. There you go. That's that. Now, what I do know is that if you upgrade item, your, your weapons and gear and stuff, even though they are only hired items and they will return back to the shop, they retain the upgrades that you've put to them. So, you, you know, the fact that you are spending your materials and stuff to upgrade these items you don't lose that. So that is at least half decent, but the fact that you have to keep buying them to use them is ridiculous. Because if you buy a premium weapon and you upgrade it and spend loads of time upgrading it with titanium upgrades and stuff, you're always gonna have to, you're always gonna be forced to, to keep paying to use that weapon. Um I don't like that. I think that's a really bad way of doing things, but everybody's got a business plan. 
Um, so that's the start. You've got some cool stuff. You've got so you got your main items. You've got pistols, knives, bombs, bonus items. Uh, you got extra. So you've got bulletproof vest, quick reloads, some kind of like little buffs, stuff like that. Diffuse kit. It's quite cool. And to give me the description. Right, there you go. So Sean's the C4 diffuse time by 35%. So on sabotage game mode, um, you can have that equipped and it reduces your diffuse time so you can do it quicker. It's pretty cool. Um, you've got various sprays, nickname change, you can buy materials, you can buy all that kind of stuff. So yeah, it's pretty cool. Uh, you can create and join clans and there's clan leaderboards. Like I said, there's the clan server. Uh, you've got missions. So you've got daily, weekly and monthly missions. Each mission card so this is the mission card um you've got a set number of different missions where they if i complete that then i get this reward if i complete all of them then i get this reward and obviously it refreshes daily refreshes weekly and refreshes monthly the the missions are kind of <sighs> poor i think um it's this is like kind of zero effort it's like okay well play three matches in construction site score 25 kills these are stuff that you're going to be doing anyway it's just passive ways to give you more more rewards which don't get me wrong more rewards isn't a bad thing but it's not really something that you're going to actively be working towards so i think that's kind of poor um this is my gear this is what i've currently got and i can equip it it's my profile which sucks i don't need to spend too much time looking at that and that's pretty much the game it is a bare bones fps shooter um, and the problem I see with it is that it isn't particularly different from most other FPS shooters of this ilk. Um, and whilst it's fun, it doesn't provide anything different. So why switch from other games to this game? I, I don't know why you would. And I don't think it's got enough to make you want to stay with this game. Five game modes is is poor very poor and this game's already been released in turkey i don't know how long it was out i don't know how long it's been out before it's been given this more global release um but still you know it's basically using the um you know the uh kind of previous mmo fps games that have been out they're not redesigning the wheel so you know throw on some extra game modes throw you know briefcase capture king of the hill you know, throw on um, just point captures, stuff like that. Um, but no, five five modes is what you get. So, oh, it's going to tell me I'm getting kicked if I don't do it in a few seconds. Uh, so there you go. That is kind of what 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 the game is all about. Um, I, I mean, there you go. You can create rooms, so you can have a look at all different types of maps. And like I said, there are you know there are quite a few, which is good. Um, can't argue with that you know there's, there's quite a few cool ones there um so that's team deathmatch i don't know so sabotage has it's on left you old town okay no so uh, so i think t i think team deathmatch just has them all and then um some of the modes only have them on certain ones maybe i don't know but yeah so you can change the win conditions game types Oh, you can choose what's the win condition. Oh, okay, earning gold. Okay, depending on. Okay, fine. I was like, oh, you get to earn. You can set a room and choose what your reward is. No. Um. So yeah, it's fun. It's pick up and try something, not particularly different, but you know, it's it's not too bad. Um. But I just don't think it has the staying power. Uh. And that's unfortunate. So there you go. That is my sporadic uh, look into Zula um, it is free to play you can check it out uh, if you like the video if you find it useful then please obviously give us a thumbs up hit the subscribe button and you'll find out when we release all our other videos check us out on Facebook and Twitter at F2Pcom and over on our official website at www.f2p.com so thank you guys for watching I have been good fellow you have been you this has been Zula and hopefully we shall see you in the next video Bye-bye.